Greetings to you out there in YouTube land, as many prepare to celebrate Easter. Uh, I'm a bit confused, though, by some, but still. Yeah, there's nothing to do at all with rabbits and eggs when it concerns Jesus and Easter. The pagans have taken over that holiday. In case many forget, Rome took uh, the pagan holidays and this included them into their pantheon of gods that they worship, an amalgamation of all one. And nothing's really changed. There was no Christmas tree either uh, when Jesus was born, and no bunch of presents. The presents were there for a good reason, so that his family would have something to sell and live on while he's over in Egypt. Remember, they're coming to kill him? You know, and having liquid cash is kind of a hard thing to do, especially when they're out of town for a census. But, hey, who am I to tell some of these people, all right? All I do is read the book. Okay, call the Bible. But many will turn around and they, they consider themselves devout. And yet they'll they'll insult God by doing pagan practices on what's supposed to be a solemn day, Easter Sunday for him. Well, they're going to turn around and they'll play with eggs, colored eggs, and do chocolates like some... A fertility right bunny of some, some pagan religion is going to really make God happy, right? That's my personal view. And if you want to honor God and celebrate a spiritual holiday, do it the right way, for the right reason, and leave all the pagan stuff out. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with eating eggs if you want them. No, yeah, it's great. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with the chocolate, too. I love chocolate. I love the eggs, right? But I don't associate them with Easter and our Lord. As any decent Christian who's not lukewarm, would agree with me because that's that's an abomination under our lord mixing with pagan practices they've got enough issues with people worshiping statues and idols right now especially when he speaks against that in leviticus 26 1 and 26 30 are the two key ones for me there's a bunch of others in there about idols too if you look but hey there's no coming back from leviticus 26 30 where it tells you that god's soul is going to hate you i mean come on <laughs> that says it all right there i don't think anything else has to be said and these pagan holidays, just, they make me weep. Honor the Lord right. Thank him for everything he did in his sacrifice that you might be here. And I might be here. Thanks to his sacrifice that he made for us. Do it the right way. Now leave the pagan stuff out, please. Have a great Easter. Bye-bye.